Hi, I'm The Lawn Smith, and in this video I'm going to show you how to use this revolutionary spreader just like a professional. Now to do that we're going to visit several lawns so that you get an idea of how easy it is to use and hopefully you can utilise that for when you come to do your, your lawn. A few points before we start. I'm wearing gloves because I'm going to have to handle the fertiliser and I'm also wearing some old trousers, wear some old clothes or put on an apron because you can get a little bit dusty from the fertilizer. So I'm going to show you another way of doing the edge, which is how I like to do it, which saves you having to do them last thing. So once again, start and do the area that you're going to stand on. Now this time I'm going to tilt the spreader and in tilting the spreader, I'm going to get more fertilizer onto the left hand side and less on the right hand side, which is going to give me an extra dose on this outside edge. It also brings in the edge a little bit, so I'm just going to take a little step closer to it and off we go. Just with a nice tilt on the spreader. You can't do this if your spreader's got wheels. An absolutely unique feature and it means the whole lawn lovely and even. Right, starting area again. And now everything is just normal as I go back down the lawn, coming to the trampoline there, just getting a little bit underneath. Once again, stop, do the starting area, and we'll go back down the lawn. Right, coming up to the trampoline now. Don't need to move it, just squat down, open the shutter, crank, let it go down. That's it. We'll do the same from the other side. So once again, from the other end of the, um, the trampoline, if, the harder you crank, the further it goes. So I can get right to the other end and just let it come in slowly, slowly and do right in front of me. And that's it, done underneath the trampoline. Right, so we've done underneath the trampoline, but I need to do something in this area here. So I just spread this area this way, turn around and carry on up the lawn. Just watching where the fertiliser goes, straight into this sort of box section here, little twist, reverse so that it gets done twice. And now I can take a step down, do a starting area, and off we go back down the lawn. All right, so once again, I'm passing the trampoline, jump down a little bit so it goes underneath. End of the lawn, do my starting area, and I've got this little nooky bit here, in and out like that, make sure it gets done twice. Let the fertilizer do the work in there and reverse back out and now I've got these edges to do. So I've got a slightly clo closed shutter there, gently spreading, going slightly sideways and that gets the fertilizer right on the edge. I've got a little bit to do here as well so I'm closing the shutter up and that's it. So all I need to do now is to go and do the corners mustn't forget the corners. Right, so we've got another lawn with the difference because we can't do this in the traditional way. So I'm going to treat this as my starting area. So I'm going to fertilize into there, walk down the lawn, and then I'm going to carry across the lawn. And then as this bit opens out, I'm going to increase the speed of the crank into that bit, into that bit, and we've done the lawn once. So now I need to reverse the procedure so that we get the lawn done twice. So once again, I'm going to stay exactly where I finished, squirt the fertilizer into that area, stand in there, go down, go across, and now the lawn is opening out on me in a slightly different fashion. So I'm going to go diagonally up here, into that little bit, into that little bit. Job done in under a minute. Next lawn, please. So here we are on another lawn, slightly different from the others in that we've got this one narrow width that's in an L shape. So as before, with overlap spreading, we need to just cover the lawn twice from two different directions. So I'm going to do the starting area. And now I'm going to turn around and go all the way back around the lawn, just making sure the fertilizer hits the edges. So nice steady pace and it just gets a bit wider. So I'm going to slow down and crank a little bit more into the corner. 
turn around and off I go to the end and stop. Now, when I want to do the end here, I can do this slightly differently rather than turning around. All I need to do is just go in reverse. That does the starting area. And now I go back down the lawn and everything gets done twice. To the end there, turn around and back up the lawn. Here we are on another lawn, similar in some respects to the lawn that we've just done, in that we're going to go and do the lawn once and then come back and repeat it. That gives us the overlap spread. This is the T shape, so I'm going to start here and you will see how it works out. The technique is just slightly different in that I need to be able to cover the lawn from left and right edge and it's wider than normal. So what I do, I spin the handle a little bit harder and I walk a little bit slower to make sure that the dosage remains the same. So spin it just a little bit wider to get to the edges, walk a little bit slower, got to the end there. I need to do the end a little bit more there and I'm back to my starting point and off I go down the lawn and I'm going to stop when this part of the tee finishes and just go into there and now I'm going to go to the end of the lawn. So here we are now at the tee of the lawn so I'm going to go and do this the bit that I need to stand on. Once again it's a bit wider than normal. Turn around, keep the spreader going a little bit wider so therefore I'm walking a little bit slower and I'm going to go all the way down to the other end of the tee. Reverse, I've done my standing area twice. Go and stand in there, and now I'll go back and I'll finish off the top of the tee. Walking a little bit slower than normal, cranking a little bit faster. There we are, that's that done. And now I'm going to go back down and finish off. So we've finished the lawn now, got some corners on this lawn, so once again, good reason to have some gloves on, just a little handshake in the corners if they happen to have not been done properly. That one's all right. I'm just going to go up to this one over here. And that just makes sure you've got everything done. Right, on to the next lawn. Right, so here we are on another lawn, got a nice big cherry tree stuck in the middle of it and we're going to treat this as one complete run. So I'm going to start in there, work all the way around and then reverse the procedure. So here we go, start spreading, go to the end, turn it off, turn around, get to the next edge. Whoops. Carry on down, down the centre duck underneath the leaves, get into the dot of the question mark, reverse it, and back around I go. Stop at the end, off to the wall there, and then right back to where I started, and everything's been done twice, overlapped nice and easy. Thanks for watching the Lord's Day.